sure you go and check that out that was yesterday's video um he got lots of presents he's super over the moon he got lots of toy story 4 stuff which he's really into at the moment he loves toy story 4 um so yeah we've just been having a chilled morning just playing with the toys and stuff like that um and now it's currently three o'clock i can't believe it's three o'clock in the afternoon it's three o'clock we're gonna go out we're gonna do a little bit of food shopping take killer to see family and friends Bulky's your favourite, isn't he? Yeah. He's playing outside with his and his toys. Bulky, let's show everybody. Bulky is his favourite one, guys. There you go. Good boy. Yeah, so we're gonna pop out, do a little bit of shopping. <laughs> um, maybe he's buying a Toy Story movie. I buy all your movies. Yeah, we might buy it on Amazon actually, so we can watch it tonight. Oh, I. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. So Caleb's had a great birthday morning so far. We've got the cake and everything to do a little bit later on. But before that, we're gonna go out. Um, we're gonna go up and queue, get some paint because I need to do like a lick of paint around the house again. Um, and yeah, so that's the plan so far. Okay, B fam. So we're currently in the car. Um, we're gonna go shopping. We're gonna get something to eat. Do you fancy something to eat? Yeah, I definitely fancy some of these. Yeah. Um, the boys actually had a lie in. They didn't wake up until about 10 o'clock this morning, which is really good for them. Um, and then obviously we just had like a lazy morning because with it being Caleb's birthday, he just wanted to chill and play with these toys and everything. So Caleb has bought his Toy Story 4 birthday presents in the car. He absolutely loves them guys, he wants to take them everywhere and we bought his scooter and Logan's bike because we're going to go for a little bike ride aren't we boys? I want to go my birthday. I know you do. You guys do, you guys clean the bike? <laughs> Dad left it on top of the shed, didn't I, in the rain? Did, yeah. I'll have to put it back in the shed. Dad got it dirty. It's okay, look, it's clean, it's not finished. It's fine. Are you taking Forky with you this time? There we go, super cute. Oh, Forky's on there, is he? Pretty good. Come on then, guys. Eventually got the park. The kids are having a bit of fun on the scooter and the bike. Caleb's never used a scooter before. Logan has, but Caleb's finding it like a little bit difficult to get used to it. Yeah. And I was asked him, what does he prefer more, a bike or a scooter? I think he just needs to get the hang of it, and then he'll be yeah. fine. It's just once he gets super fast, he doesn't realise to put like both feet on the scooter, like to cruise. He thinks yeah. he always have to push. 
with your first? It's more like for Caleb, it's like he's that used to riding a bike that from a jump on a scooter, he's thinking, oh, how do I do this? How does this one work? But yeah, I think obviously you've attempted to park a few times of it, you should get the hang of it. Just like you do with the bike? Yeah, but yeah. do you remember those t uh, scooters in, not Smith's, but <laughs> you got four of you of us. Go Not Smith's, the other store next to Smith's down in Teen Valley. I forgot it, it's the camping store. Oh yes. They had those big scooters there. Yeah. They were proper sick, those scooters. They were really good. They were fun adults, so I was thinking, yeah, we'll make it some of them for Christmas or something. They were like for Diane and Sean's yeah, as well. Yeah, the wheels were they? huge on them, they were like electrical. You can get electrical scooters, you know. Yeah, I've seen those yeah. as well. You can get electrical bikes as well. Thank Def you. Defies the fact of exercise, though, doesn't it? <laughs> I suppose it's easy like, to, like, to get around it if you want to get around a bit quicker and stuff. So we're just gonna like spend half an hour in the park and then we'll probably go food shopping after this. Yeah. yeah. Do you wanna do some food shopping or do you wanna go for a bite to eat first? Probably a bite to eat. Because you know if I don't if I, if I don't get a bite to eat before I go food shopping and I buy more shopping than I actually That's need. That's very true, yeah. So um, yeah, we'll go for a bite to eat. But some with this pregnancy, like I'm just not feeling that hungry. Yeah, I've yeah. noticed that with you. I'm just like not eating that much, I'm not um feeling hungry. It's like I don't want to eat kind of thing. Yeah. And I've been like not knowing what to cook kind of thing. Because like, like, the fun thing you know, we plan on these together. So that is us finished up in the park kids have enjoyed themselves it's started to rain a little bit a bit of drizzles come down there so i think we'll leave just in case it gets a bit heavy so i think they were going for a meal or just quickly grabbing like a greg's or something like that like a grab and go food kind of thing but stephanie was mentioning that i don't know if anybody from the local area remembers this place but it's called t barns next to the metro center on the on the roundabout and um it's changed now and now they've got like a soft play in it and stuff so Stephanie was saying well we should go there put the kids in the soft play you should hear the thunder guys that's actually thundering and we just get a bite to eat and stuff um, but then we've got here's the rain here's the rain but time consuming we we'll think we might just grab like, grab and go food like from Greg's or something but I'm gonna have to put this camera away guys because it's starting to lash it down I'll catch up you guys in just a bit. Just popped to KFC for something to eat guys. We went for, Sean's went for a Flamin' All Star. I went for a BBQ one because I can't have a Flamin' All Star because I've got mayonnaise in. Um, but to make up for it guys, I got one of these which is a salted caramel waffle cruffle, truffle, crush them. <laughs> Another tongue twister, isn't it? Um, Looks pretty good. Mm. You got a big lump of chocolate now, I'd pick that out before it melts to the bottom. Yeah, taste that though, Sean. So it'll go. I'm not like nice. normally a sweet type of guy. I'm not really a sweet stuff, but. Wow. <laughs> it's nice, isn't it? Yeah, packs a punch that. It's good. Okay, guys, so we popped by a local Asda supermarket to get some things. We're also going to go over to Aldi, which is just across the road from here get a few more things from there then we were gonna go to B&Q but to be quite honest with you guys it's getting a little bit late so we're gonna go to B&Q tomorrow get some things from B&Q tomorrow probably gonna be like blinds and stuff like that because we're looking to get some new blinds um, for the living room and our bedroom because the ones in the kitchen look absolutely beautiful so we're gonna go for those they're a bit difficult to cut like when you need to cut them they like, to fit um, but I think they're going to be worth it in the long run so we're going to go to B&Q tomorrow and get some blinds for the living room and the bedroom. Um, I think Stephanie wanted to pick up some white paint, I thought I had like a full tub of white paint but it was magnolium so it's a totally different colour but we're all feeling a little bit tired, it's like late afternoon now, it's like nearly 6, 7 o'clock so we're going to pop into Asda do a bit of shopping. So we're currently inside of Asda and we're just looking at like their games, the family games because we love a good family game don't yeah. we? Um, but I was speaking to Kayla's speech therapist before we broke up for six weeks and she says like stuff like this is great for him and then on the bottom of the fish you put like a letter and then when he hooks the fish the letter that you get you have to like try and practice it with him and then like get him to practice a word that begins with that sound. That's pretty good so we're just like looking for a few games yeah. This one looks good. I don't know if anybody plays this game but a game of chess but this has got like 10 different games in it as well. So, might get that, £10. What do you think? Should we get a chessboard? 
Yeah, I think that'll be fun. A few hours later. So we're currently back home, Bee Fam. We're just going to chill for the rest of the night. We're going to watch a Toy Story movie on Amazon. And <laughs> Caleb's just playing with his toys down there. He's had so much fun today, honestly, guys. So we're going to watch Toy Story and then we're going to order in. The children really want to order in a Pizza Hut. So we're going to see if they order in. Maybe someone knows if Pizza Hut don't deliver. So what is the game called? Is it called The chess? game is called... My arm's on, which one got yours? Yeah. It's called chess, but you've got 10 other games in there as well. And it comes in this nice little box as well, doesn't it? Basically, it's an old man's game, but to be quite honest with you guys, it's also like a game where you've got to use your brains. See, I love games. Like, it's a family yeah. that love playing games and mm -hmm. like having an, like, an evening in and just playing games and stuff like that. I like just relaxing games like that. Yeah. Where you got to like plan your steps and everything. So we're going to put Toy Story 4 on, order some food in, and then after that food we'll probably play a game with this. Are we going for Indians, Chinese, or pizza? Oh. Pizza. Everyone wants pizza. 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 No, I don't mind it, but I've got, like, I don't mind an odd cheeky kebab once in a while. Yeah. But uh, after a while, I think, like, no, I can't, I can't eat love, them that much. Yeah, we used to love Domino's, but since we stopped doing the nachos, we don't like them, do we? No, I love a Chinese, uh, so. The yeah, all I feel like Chinese. Great, isn't he? Mm -hmm. But so I just can't make my mind of what I want to eat. You need to be careful for spicy food as well. Yeah, I've got so to you'll be on a coal mine if you go for an Indian. Yeah. Caleb, you want to play with your play doh, didn't you? Yeah. So Caleb wanted to play with his play doh little dentist set. <laughs> Takeaway has been delivered. We've got some pizza for the children, and um, that's a garlic bread there. And then we got oh, that looks pretty nice, doesn't it, guys? What? Yeah, there's your pizza, and then me and Sean got an Indian. Yeah, but what else? I went for like non spicy food, so I went for a coma because I can't have spicy food. When I'm pregnant. So me and Stephanie have got this mixed kebab starter. You get like an onion bargee with it. And you get like a battered tikka chicken there. And then obviously you've got tikka chicken, tikka lamb underneath there. With this kofot, if I'm pronouncing that right. So yeah guys, that is one of our starters. We'll show you guys another starter that we've got also. We also got a nice chicken chat. Um, comes with this nice lovely bread. It's absolutely lovely. So that is our second starter. So me and Stephanie, we get two starters, but we just share them. So we've had our food. Food was absolutely delicious. Yeah, just what we needed, nice. guys. I know we had two takeaways in the same day. We had a KFC, and then we ordered in. But we had that kind of day where we've just not, not had, not like not had the motivation, but been so busy that we've not had time to cook. Yeah. That's yeah, what we'll I have think. Them days, don't you? Yeah, I've got yeah. loads of food in the fridge and everything. I mean, I could just show you right now. <laughs> I've got loads of food in the fridge already prepped and everything. But we just not had time to like pull it out. So it's just a quickly grab and go food for everyone, hasn't it been today? Yeah. But it's been nice though, because you don't do that every day, do you? Yeah, yeah. So it's we, been nice, okay, let's We went day. to the beach the other day where it was nice and sunny and we sat on like the cliff edge with some fish and chips just overlooking the ocean of Blythe and it was just beautiful. It was just lovely just to sit and just chill. We had like a real zen moment, didn't we? We were just like, we did, yeah. Just totally just chilled out. So with that being said, guys, we're going to love you and leave you. Yeah. Thank you to everybody else who has given the video a like and everybody who is new, welcome guys to the Batista family vlogs. Um, Stephanie will be doing some more pregnancy videos and talking a little bit more about our journey. And guys, we're going to end the vlog. Love you guys and leave you guys our beautiful be from us. Remember, hashtag be yourself, hashtag be different. Until then guys, good night.